Oh my god! What? Look. No way! There's... There's the fun. Two needles and a spoon right there. Ooh. We need locking nuts. Man. He got tased. Welcome back to Treasure Hunting with Jeebus, guys. And we are here at Public Storage yet again because we picked up another storage unit. Another one. It's getting crazy out here in California. This one's a 5x5. Five five. We paid 80 bucks for the unit, which is really, really surprising because right inside, I see the money back already. So don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new. Let's get into it. Kaboom! So right when they open this door up, I said in my head, we'll go at least 150 because right at the front, there's three laptops in plain sight. So I was like, we'll go at least 150 because if, if they're cheap, you should still be able to get like 40, 50 bucks for them. We stopped at 80. I was like, what? We'll take that all day. First one right here is a Dell Inspiron. They look a bit older, so they probably have an older operating system. Yeah, this one's running Windows XP. At least it says. We don't know yet. We got to plug it up. Sometimes they can upgrade the OS on it, but... It might be Windows XP still. People love it. Windows yeah. XP is the best. Yeah, people still buy uh, computers with Windows XP all the time because they love it. You still buy Windows XP software. Same with Windows 7. They love them. We got another HP right here. Mm, that's a tight something Windows. Windows XP again. Look at that. Two laptops right off the bat. See, I think a lot of people are scared off because a lot of people that store them will take parts. But look at this. These are intact as far as we can see. Now we'll plug them up when we get home if we can find chargers. Actually, I have a charger that has multiple ends. so. We'll plug them up when we get home. Last but not least, another HP here. Kaboom. Oh, wrong side. This one has Windows 7 on it. So Hopefully look at that. Right? They're missing a couple keys though. But that's all right. So we paid 80 bucks for it. Just started and we've already found three laptops. How can you beat that for 80 bucks? Next, we're gonna take this little thing out and see what we got. Ugh. All right, let's get down here. So, Instruction manual. We actually just said we needed one of these in the house. Power strip. These are like seven bucks at Walmart too. So hey, money saver. This is all brand new printer papers. So something tells me we'll probably find the printer in here too that goes with the laptop. Uh, that was a cell phone at one time. Oops. What do we got here? Ooh, hello. County and administration. This is jail papers. Jail papers. We got, what's in here? Just random junk. Let me sit down. Pavement and the knee is not a good combination, especially when you're big and fat. All right, spray bottle. Look at this. Yeah, you're right. Too fat to be standing. Look at this. If this was 1955, like, we'd be set. Look at this little TV. Let's watch. Whatever on it. Let's watch Treasure Hunting with Jeebus on it. Oh, you think it has Treasure Hunting with Jeebus? It's not that cool, actually. I hate, I hate that game. He's kind of annoying. Oh, here we go, guys. Let's get a little bit closer. Because we already got some juicy stuff. So, <laughs> look what we got. You see how it's wrapped up in tape, right? What's the first thing you see right there? There's uh -oh. your scale for weighing it out already. We're just getting in here. That's where they kept their weed at. Let's see if we can get a little bit deeper. These are hand warmers right there. Uh, T-Mobile welcome kit. Oh look, a little cat. Mama Jeebus got the hand warmer. You finding stuff already? <laughs> uh, somewhat. Some screws. And in here we got some battery packs. Why is it wrapped up like that? I know, look, look, look at the way they taped this up. Like, that just looks like you're trying to hide fishy. something. Just a little bit. It's all about you. Thank you. All right, what else we got in here? Straws. Look at this little heart. What do you think's in there? Nothing, that's a jewelry box. So maybe we'll find a ring of some sort. And there's their lighter. We got their scale. We got their, it's where they kept lighter. it. There's their lighter. It's emoji lighter. I know, right? That looks like it's something that goes off a dresser, doesn't it? You mean a handle? That's what those things are called. Screws. <laughs> 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 uh, is that rolling paper or what? Rolling paper. Yeah. Rolling paper. Now we're just missing the actual weave. She's probably gone. 
Holy crap. Yeah, they used all this for that. Candle. And we got Metro cards and that's it for there. Keep going through it. I saw the scale and knew something was gonna be fishy quick. We got a little pocket fan. I didn't break that. We have it's a little plastic container to sell stuff in or store stuff in. And we got some more pills already. Nap naprexin? You know what that is? Naproxen. Naproxen. I heard that before. The pill says IP189 on it. Not sure. We'll Google that and let you know later. So we have like some little dishes in here too where they look really cheap. This is a magnet. Okay, why do they have just a random magnet? Look. Who doesn't okay. have a random magnet? Um, That's the real question. What is this? <laughs> Open it. What is that? Oh, it's leaking, isn't it? it sure is. It's Smell it. something black. Mmm, what is that? Ugh. It smells awful. It's touching your fingers. Is it? Ah! Oh! It's burning! I don't know what that is. I don't know if I want to know either. It's kind of weird. That's why I used to wear gloves, guys. Yeah, but I'm not that bright. I left them all in my van. Yeah, I want you to notice something. It's like pulling everything in there. Yep. It's just a bunch of dishes. I don't really know what it is. But the reason we're not wearing gloves, you guys know we have been. It's just we put them all in our van and we drove the car to California, so we just haven't got anything new. There's a little feather bell. And other than that, guys, it looks like the rest of the stuff's junk. Let's keep going. All right, so we just pulled a little bit more out of there. Look who we find hiding. Somebody's got a nice, fancy looking bong here. It's got a nice pink base, some green in there, some blue up here. Pretty. It's a nice, it's actually for a bong, I mean, it's pretty. Nice bong. Oh, a bong. Bong. Uh, not a bomb. A bong. Bong. <laughs> I said bong, not bong. Who's seen Harold and Kumar Guantanamo Bay? I was just about to say that. What do we no, got no, here? No, what is that? Bong. It says kiss on it. It's a freaking needle. Look. Kiss it. <laughs> Ew. What is it? I don't know. It's a needle? It looks like a needle. I don't know. Hand sanitizer. Nothing. And this one's got some lotion and other things on it. In here, first thing I see is a nice dark gray uh, Nine West purse. And look, it still has the little tag on it, so it's probably never used. Mama G was eyeballing it. Yeah, nice. <laughs> eyeballing it. I like it. Merry Christmas. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see what else we got going in here. Crap. What is this? Look at this bag. It looks Ooh. like pink snake skin. <laughs> That's actually really pretty. I really like that one. It doesn't have a brand on it, but it looks nice. Look at that. Looks like pink snake skin, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Yep. That's super cute. Where's the pink snake at? I don't know. I got a pink snake, I'm gonna name it Pirate. <laughs> we got polka dots. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, guys. What is that little pill? Anybody have a phone? <laughs> one side of it says OP, one side of it says 20. Google. Ooh, look at this little white one here. What brand is this one? I don't know, it doesn't have a brand on it again. It has a C. It almost looks like it's just a fake Coach because it looks like the Coach stuff inside. That might be what it's meant to be. It might just be a fake Coach or something like that. More stuff. What do we got in here? I can't get it open. Oh, there we go. Hey, there's a card in here. The Shan oh, there's a couple cards in here. Any gift cards? Let's see, the Shanta Club, Club, and a Chick-fil-A calendar for 2017. Ah, why couldn't it have been a Chick-fil-A gift card? I know everybody has like, like some people are against Chick-fil-A for other reasons. They have the best uh -oh. chicken sandwich this in the room. This pill right here, option. guys, An is option. Oxycontin. Well, here we go again. <laughs> did that focus enough? Yeah, it did, okay. I can see it. Here's one more purse. This one is a Kenneth Cole New York bag right there. And I'm gonna scoot this stuff aside and pull some more out. All right guys, so the storage got a little bit more interesting. We already found one of the letters is from the storage unit owner's son who is locked up. And we also found out the owner of the storage unit is also locked up, all drug related, of course. But let's keep going. First thing we got, whoa, is a bag and more pills. No, that one's empty actually. But, oh whoa, see this is why you should be careful and look in the bag first. 
<laughs> that was just sitting in there all by itself. Can I? Yeah, I don't think any glove would have helped against that. But there's just random stuff in there, like a brush and a back scratcher. Nothing important. Ugh. There's the printer we said we were gonna find earlier. We have found the laptop, we found printer paper, so we knew the printer was to come. We'll set that aside. What else have we got in here? There's another purse at the bottom. This one's a DKNY purse right there, as you can see. Doesn't feel like there's nothing in there, but we'll check it anyway. What is that? El Salvador, a little thing. But other than that, guys, that's all full of clothes with one purse, so we'll go ahead and set this tote aside and keep pulling stuff out. All right, so we got the next box out. Let's see what we got. First thing first, what is that? It's like a light bulb. It does, like look. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a light bulb. It almost looks like a vial. Without this part, it would look like a vial. You see like a mad scientist in a cartoon spinning some chemicals around. Some RuneScape stuff. Basically. What is that? Hair stuff. Ugh, we got another purse here. Let's see if we got a good brand this time around. Like yeah, that's Michael Kors. I like it. Merry Christmas again. Thank you. Yay! <laughs> Free purses. <laughs> There's a basket. Can somebody explain to me what people use baskets for? When I find them at first, I used to just toss them, but we started keeping them every time we sell baskets at a flea market or yard sale, people buy all of them. I don't know what they're using baskets for in this day and age. I always think of like a picnic, like a red riding hood. That's what I think of. I think of a basket, I think of a picnic. Look at that, Barney color bag, woo. Ooh, here's another nice looking purse too. This one is, what is this? You see that, one, a that one's her size. That one is? Oh, uh -huh. that, yeah, that's super cute. Let's see, can I get another one? Is like this is bag? my unit. <laughs> I don't see a brand on it anywhere, so it might it's be okay. cheaper, but hey, there it is. What is this, just a regular day-to-day -day bag? Nothing in it. Little blue one. What's in here, you think? Money. Nothing. Million dollars. Right, one of them's gonna have a million dollars. <laughs> we got some paperwork here. Let's see if we can find out what this is. medical records and just addresses nothing important so let's keep going through the box look at that vase vases are one of those things I always say this like I swear two of them could look similar one of them could be worth like a thousand dollars and one of them came from the Dollar Tree they're really hard to tell we got another little bag here it has nothing let's see if I can turn it over some you can see what's in there What is this giant piece of wood for? <laughs> giant piece of wood. Okay. There's a bunch of cards down here. Let's see what we got going on. Hold on, guys. Hopefully they're not all bank cards. Bank, bank, bank. Uh, this one's an actual, that's a green dot. Don't you need, this one's a prepaid. Prepaid Visa right there. I'm gonna go through all of them and see what we can find really quick. There's a lot of cards in here. I mean, look at this. This one's a $15 grocery store card. That one's a bank card. <laughs> are these gift cards bank you find? Card. The ones I'm tossing here are bank card. How many bank accounts does this person have? I don't know. There's a Rite Aid gift card. Bank and there's Safeway Club card. It's not going to have money on it. Let's see. Oh, good hat. It's obviously gonna be fake though. Let me see. Yeah, but it's not real, so a buck maybe. But other than that, it looks like this box is nothing but random junk. All right, so she's uh, calling the gift cards as we're recording. Let's keep going. First thing I find, Brandon, is for you. Oh, wow. Will you be my Valentine? <laughs> yes, I will. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna re-gift it to Pirate later. So. <laughs> you want me to have your heart? Yeah. Will you be my Valentine? It's a little early, but of course I will. <laughs> <laughs> what, is what is that? What is this? Guarantee, photo, mono, handmade in Italy. Crystal. I have no paper idea. Weight? Just a paperweight? You want some noodles? They're only maybe... Let's find a date on them. I always like finding the dates of food in here. Here we go. Actually, they're still good. October 1st, 2020. You want them? Any information on the gift cards? Yeah, this one said 17 cents. Oh. <laughs> so 
Boo. Oh my gosh, what's with all it's these up. connives everywhere trying to take people out? All open too. I know, some of these are a little crazy, aren't they? What is that? Lock it, spray something, whatever. Ooh, we got a jewelry box. What do you think's in there? Jewelry. Oh no, there's two decks of cards. All right, we'll take that. That's probably what we'll, we'll take it. Here's the jewelry, I saw it. Where'd you go? No, oh, come back. Oh, it's this. Oh, I thought that was like something gold right there. It's just a strap handle. There's some glasses in there. Any Ray-Ban or anything? Nope. All right, this, uh, sorry. This Save Mart card, I have to go to customer service because the number isn't like activated. <laughs> So, so far, the gift cards are actually pushed my box. <laughs> this box is junk. We're gonna throw this one aside and pull a new one out in just a second. All right, so we just pulled out another box. Let's see what we got. The first thing we got is a box and a box. A gift box, too. What do you think's in the box? Hopefully a box. A box! No, it's not. It's, okay, just think of the most random assortment of objects you can find. We got a tissue. Ew. A mini-sized Hershey syrup bottle. Yeah. Uh, well, whatever this is. How's this open? This looks like it should open, but it's not opening. Figure that out in a second. Oh, there it is. It's another scale. There we go. This is the second one already we found. Here you go, Brandon. I know you like these. Poker, poker oh, yes. chips. Let's go. I always have to get these from casinos we go to. Yeah, every casino we go to. I don't play table games, but he always makes me go to the table and get chips from every time we go to a casino. A mini lock. A pair of glasses. And some chapstick. I just want to know what's going through people's mind when they're packing stuff up. Did you put the little lock with the syrup bottle? In the same bag with the tissues and poker chips? Look at this. It's just a, this is a blue feather in there. Like, what is this? Why is there a blue feather in this thing? What was that? We just lost money. Money found in storage unit. There it is. I just saw <laughs> it. I bought them in a storage unit. Yeah, storage unit finds. <laughs> you want to do your hair? Yes. There'll be another basket. Is that a treasure chest? Huh? It's a treasure chest. A little oh, chest. Look, Look at this. Is first. this like. What is that? The memories? It's not an ass. Is it like RAM or memory? Whatever it, is, it says on the back, 256 megabytes, so it's pretty irrelevant in this day and age, whatever it is. We got a little pink thing. It's nothing. A couple more cards. All bank cards. How many bank cards does one person need? Finding Dory, Binkton. Nothing. Other than that, guys, complete just random assortment of pretty useless items in this box. All right, so we just pulled out this big FedEx box. It looks like at one point it was taped up. We didn't rip the tape, so somebody might have already taken what they wanted out of here. Maybe they just reused the mailbox. Let's see what we got. Oh, guys, guys, guys. We got a jewelry box. Look at that. First thing we find is a jewelry box. What do you think's inside? No wow. dice. Super glue. <laughs> and a nail. And a nail. That's probably to open the super glue. Top drawer doesn't open. Oh, the top does. You ready? Three, two, one. There's one in there. A little ring that I don't think could end up being actual silver. Look at that, you can already see it's already rusted on the back. Silver's not gonna rust like that, so. You got just a fake little ring. That thing. We had another little chest though. I think that's a jewelry box too. Or what is this? I don't even know. Look at the bottom. Any idea what that is? Is it open? That's a million dollar chest. We'll figure it out in a second. We had a couple books here. Just random junk. What is that? A wooden cup? Wooden cup? 99 cents they bought it. And a bird. Oh wait, that bird opens. <sighs> These tapes shut. Slide. I'm trying to get this tape <laughs> off too. Why do I have such problems with this stuff? Guys, allow me. <laughs> Give me one second. Pass it down. Alright, that's all it's in here. We'll let the smart people open this stuff because I'm incapable and we'll be right back. Yeah. All right, so we figured the bird out. You lift this up right here, like that, and then this comes off. But there's actually nothing in there. There's actually a pretty smart little secret compartment there. I would not have figured that out. I would have slammed it on the ground until I got it open. Luckily, we have some good people here. Let's go into this one. This one too supposedly slides really easily like that. 
which I couldn't get for some reason, but wait, this one does have some little gold bracelets in it, which are probably, judging off of everything else, gonna end up being fake too. I don't see markings on it, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. And here's the little handle part of it. Oh, it does say something on it. Let's see, there's a little tiny writing on it. And I cannot read it. So, we'll figure that out and let you know once we get to the next box. So we have a nice pink and blue basket thing here. Let's handle it Jeebus style, right? Set it down peacefully. Everyone else is being aggressive. They gotta learn to be like me and treat everything with respect. Like this is how you do it respectfully, see? Yeah, That's can, how it's supposed to be. Can you hand me that container real quick? This one? Yeah, sure. What are you gonna do with it? I just wanna look at it. That's a pretty cool container. <laughs> oh my gosh. We'll just set it down gently. Look what we also got here. That looks pretty complete right there. It looks like a whole little wrench set. And we also got this right here, little jar. <laughs> Alright, else we also have a little jar here. What do you think's inside of it? A million dollars. Cool stuff. Nothing. Oh, I saw the jar for what? This 3, 4, might be part of the laptop charger, though. That's what it looks like to me, like one of the ends. Cool brick. Part that plugged into the brick. Yep. What have we got in here? I know oh, that bag. Newspaper and bubble wrap. Ew. This bag's kind of grimy. What do we got here? It's a mirror! Sure. Oh. Why did I do that? I'm glad you didn't just hold it up. You want these? Yes. No, not really! <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, here's the story right there. Do it on pirate. That's the story. Oh, we got another purse down here. Hey, you've been talking like you like crystal light, right? Yeah. Guess we got Snapple, tea, diet, Snapple. There you go. Nobody <laughs> say it like that. Diet tea. <laughs> snapple tea. I was reading it. Diet snapple tea. St. John's Bay purse over here. St. John's. Which is also purse. completely empty. And other than that, we just got a sweater and one other piece of cloth. So I was going to say we pulled the next tote, but we kind of didn't. We pulled out the next cooler, I guess. We got a cooler full of stuff. Oh, we got some chocolate. Hot chocolate. Yeah, this stuff's so good. Look at that. Nice little vase thing. What? So gentle. Opium. I thought I, I read something else on there. Opium with an M, not a D. So we have some perfume there. This is the cringiest thing I've ever said. Brandon, read this to us. I can't even read that. <laughs> read it. Hashtag selfie kit. Oh, God. Oh! What? Here we go. This is their... Scooch forward! Scooch forward! Scooch, scooch! <laughs> yeah. Alright, I have another piece of interesting evidence. Hold that, on. There's... There's the fun. Look, right there. Right the Alright, this goes right here. Here you go. What are they arrested for? Um, this is Look at that. What does that smell like? Well, I'm not smelling that's that. That's a crack pipe, isn't it? Pipe. Yeah. That's a crack pipe. Yeah, look at that. And there's all their lighters. Look. There it is, guys. Be careful. You shouldn't touch any. What's that? Record. Not anymore, but it was. Hashtag selfie kit. I don't know if you want to take many selfies <laughs> with this stuff. Just All saying. Right, so the piece of paper that Mama Jeebus found. Don't show is, the names. Yeah, I folded the name. So the problem is drug slash alcohol use, heroin, methamphetamine. So that's exactly meth. goes with that whole. That, that looks like a crack pipe it to me. A, it yeah. was a treatment plan for methadone. It was going to methadone clinic. Drugs ruin people, man. They ruin people. Alright, let's go to the other back. Another bag. A shirt. That. Oh, I wonder what this could be. I wonder if this is anything shady by any chance. Probably not. By the way, we have this little... Is this a hard drive? That's a... I don't even know. Like a CD player? I don't know. It looks like a... That's a DVD drive. Look. A DVD player? I don't know. Oh, there you go. I don't know. But... I wonder what's randomly wrapped up in the tape. Something nice, right? Like a college degree or... Yeah, it's your diploma. It's the master's. You need a knife? No, we're getting it. It's a spoon, this, this is. It's a spoon? Yep, I can already tell you. Ooh, wow. Well, yeah, don't, don't really touch it, but try to show it. Can you cut open the thing without touching it? I can show you guys, look. Look right here. You can see right there. You want this? Let me see it. This is probably where the heroin was done. 
You gotta heat the heroin up in the spoon and stuff. Why don't you just make a whole house too? Look. That's exactly what that is, and that's why it's taped what up like that. Look, um, is it a needle? It's huh? a needle. A is needle? it? It's a needle. Let's get it all the way open. I can just eat. I can see it from the thing, but you don't have to open it if you don't want. I'm gonna open it just to show. Be careful, please. There's oh, a needle in there too? There's a needle. It's covered though. Yeah, it's Here, tell me. I can just stick a camera in it. I don't know, but it's bothering me now. Look. Yeah, okay. Boom. Two needles and a spoon right there. There's the heroin kit. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy, yeah. First time I ever found that. Straight out of intervention. Yeah. That's, that's We're finding new drugs. Since we've come to California, I feel like it's been even more than home. But weed, I get. Weed's legal out here, but the other stuff, not so much. He's using my dolphin knife, guys. That's why it's failing for that. It's literally cut this. Imagine, what is it gonna be for the Dolphins? It's gotta be like the Raiders, the 49ers, or one of those teams to get cut that bad. Let's see what's in here. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, yeah. oh, it's just... That's just a nice jewelry box, actually. Not bad, not bad. There's one more little thing in here. Let's get to it. Yeah, oh. <laughs> Never guess. A foldable scale. Third scale we found in here. I wonder what they use that for. I wonder. Probably to weigh jewelry, right? Yeah, they weigh jewelry and other means of weighing other things that are completely legal. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure. But in all actuality, guys, this is the third scale. We found the heroin needles, we found the spoon. All right. Hold on a second. Hold on. Look what I just found. <laughs> what do you think? a lot of here? Like, good stuff here. Did this come off? Oh, just an actual empty container. Did you find anything else? So. Okay, so this, these like few papers right here, it's like a case report. So they have like different sections on this paper for what they found. And right here it said, um, no arrests have been made. No, they have the maid open up door. The bounty hunters only search bed number two. So they had bounty hunters come into their home and search it. So like these pictures right here are pictures of like checkbooks and um, checks, I mean, social security cards that they found. And there was also a picture of a gun Come back Whoa. to me when I find that, because <laughs> I lost it. Well guys, we're gonna scoot this stuff aside and just keep moving forward. Guys, the story just keeps getting juicier and juicier. So uh, as we were going through the paperwork, we've already found out that they've had the house raided by bounty hunters, but they had a picture of a gun, which we're trying to find again. I'll show you before the video ends. We found it. We also found this one, which is a hoard of different people's social security cards and wallets and uh, checks from other people that the people have stolen and tried to use. So. They weren't just drug dealing, doing drugs. They were also stealing people's credit cards and social security information, which is, these people are gonna be locked up for a long time. Let's put it like that. Here First it thing, found it. there it is. <laughs> so you guys don't think we're lying. Look, they found a gun hidden under the bed. Obviously they're a felon. They're not allowed to have a gun. So they found guns and drugs and stolen stuff. This is Look a wild storage unit. Look at this bong. This one was in the back behind this toe. This one's massive. We pretty much found like every drug known to man. Found two bongs, so we know they smoke. I mean, we don't really consider weed a drug, but it's still some place is illegal. We found the oxycotton pill in there. Where's that at? Uh, we even show them that's what it was. Yeah, I showed it on the phone. Okay, but yeah. So we found out it was an oxycotton. Then we have the heroin over there, and then the selfie kit that has a crack pipe in it. So we've literally found every drug under the sun so far in this unit. Let's keep going. We found Eminem. Found Eminem M &M. storage in it. I'm Slim Shady or something, the real shady. <laughs> Copyrighted. <laughs> Copyrighted. Eminem found in storage in it. Let's see, is this a Playboy purse? This is a Playboy purse, look at that. It's even got the Playboy bunny on the front. <laughs> this one is a Tupperware purse. Tupperware, I don't know Tupperware. I don't know, me neither. Golden thing. Oh, what is, that's a taser. Taser. Really? Yeah. Oh, it's, it works, it works. Where's Jack? Press it. Ooh. Ooh. I need watching that. He got tased. No. Tase the tase everyone watching right now. That's cool. Ready guys? I'm gonna tase all of you. Is it focused on it? Hold uh on. -huh. Do it. Oh now it's not working. <laughs> That's pretty brutal. This this one just keeps getting more epic. Who wants to get tased? Go taste fire. Yeah, interesting. This is an interesting unit. There's a dirty bathroom mat. Oh, 
Unfortunately, that's everything with this in this tote. This tote is still nothing but bathroom mat, so not gonna waste your time going through that. Let's pull out a little bit more. We're almost done, but there's still much more to go through. All right, so we've done pulling out the next box. Guys, these people have done every drug known to man. They were selling it, they were doing it. They're just, this is crazy. First thing we got, tape. We can always use tape. And we have this thing, Eureka Mighty Might. What is that? Any idea what that looks like? Uh, no idea. Huh, no clue. Another vacuum? Wonder if it's to suck up the smell of what they're doing. The wind's opening the door. Ooh. That's creepy. Look at this. Uh, we'll save that. We'll save that. Let's go through this first. Actually, I'm going to feel around it, make sure nothing's hidden, but it feels like all closed, so we'll just toss that one aside. Let's see what's in this box. You want to open it here? Oh my god! What? Look. No way! Heroin no spoon way. again. There's another crack pipe. I and mean, there's Jeez, needles man. all in here. Man, Look at this. Needle. There's weed too. I smell the weed. Yeah. Let's just take it all out. You want me to go through right here? You want me to go through right here? Let's get this inside really quick. So we'll see it Look at that. There's a broken crack pipe right there. There's another spoon for heroin. And Look you, at all those. You needles. see what's on that spoon too? What? Black. Yep. Look right here. There's another broken crack pipe. And look at all these needles right here. That's nasty. It's like what Jack found. Yeah, this is like his the most dangerous unit ever. You haven't seen that one. That was pretty crazy too. You should go check it out on Locker Nuts. But look at that. Those are all heroin needles. This is by far the most drug, drugs and drug paraphernalia we've ever come across in a storage unit. It's a five by five. Let's keep going. Blankets. Blankets. Some gold bond. At this point, that's probably cocaine in there. Who knows anymore? <laughs> some more that blankets. Huh? If there's that much cocaine, make your money back storage. Yeah, I'd rather not be the drug dealer. Yeah. <laughs> All that's in there is blankets, unfortunately. Nothing else too incriminating. But there's a little bit more stuff in there, so we're gonna go get that out and go through the last bit. So we pulled out the last few things in there. One thing we found that's great is this basket of wires, and we can see at least two laptop chargers in here, so We'll 100% be able to get these laptops on. Now, let me tell you, when we first got here, I was excited to get in these laptops. Now, after learning what we've learned and found what we found, I am super excited to get in those laptops because no telling what information is going to be on there. It might have to be turned into the police. We don't know at this point. And if we go in here, we also have another like pink rubbery purse. The only other thing in the unit, and not throw it at me. I thought you were throwing it at me. There's two more things in the unit that are important. I guess there's a fan in there, which honestly is one of the main reasons we bought it to begin with, because I wanted to put a fan in our house we're renting. And two, there's a heater in there. Other than that, guys, that's all we found in this crazy little unit. All right, guys, so as far as real value, we don't have too, too much. We have a heater, a fan, and some laptops, and some purses. I mean, we'll make a little bit of money, not much, but the story that came with this unit was totally worth it for us. It's so cool to like read in people's stories and just see what really happened. So let's do a recap on all the crazy stuff we really found. First things first, let's go through all these drugs. We got out one Oxycontin and we found the papers that they did have methamphetamine, so who knows what else, what else they had with them. We found more pain pills here. We also got one bong, two bongs. These are both for smoking weed. I know everyone, everyone's opinion is gonna differ. Some people say weed's a drug, some people say it's not. And they are smoking weed. We have the meth pipes here. One, two, two that are broken, and one that's complete, that if you look directly in it, it even still has meth in not, it. Not right focus. there. Well, it focus, it's pretty small. It's not gonna focus. But take our word for it, there's still meth in it. Then we found, I don't even know how many heroin needles, like six or seven heroin needles, along with one, two spoons that still have the black on it, and look at the bottom. They were quite obviously used for heroin. We found this little duct tape upset, which has the spoon and two needles in it. But you know what the weird part about this one is? It's not actually burnt. So you know what my guess with this is? They're selling. This is how you sell it to somebody. There's your needles, there's your spoon. If you look in there, there's more in there. So we know they're drug dealing as well as abusing the drugs. So probably selling drugs to afford their own drugs, so I had to take a guess. We also have this in here which look like more meth and heroin paraphernalia. 
And then we have, of course, the knife I just set aside. This also looks like once upon a time was used for heroin. That's nasty. That's wild. And then of course we have the papers, the confiscated checks and social security card that they had stolen, the illegal gun they had that was under a bed here. And then we have all kinds of just arrest records here. Selling it, using it. No personal stuff. Illegal guns, it's showing it. I don't want to show it. But yeah, they were selling drugs, using drugs, illegal weapons, all kinds of crazy stuff. And don't forget, we have the three laptops over there. If you guys want to know what's on the laptops, let us know down in the comments and we'll put it at the beginning of the next video. Only if we get enough people that are interested in it. So if you really want to know, make sure you let us know down in the comments. But anyway guys, that's going to be it for this crazy unit. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, make sure you leave it a big fat thumbs up if you're not already. Hit that subscribe button for awesome treasure hunting videos all the time. And if you do want to follow us on our social media links, they're going to be on screen. Click the links down in the description. Make sure you follow us on whatever you have. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, peace out.